today was a community event. It was a fun day aimed at um, people under 16. There was football, dodgeball, rounders and arts and crafts. And really, it was just about having fun, uh, bringing everyone together. I think the highlight was the rounders tournament. That was when everyone took part, the parents and the youngers as well. It was just, it put a smile on my face, seeing everyone play and encouraging people. I think one of the people that were playing football, they, he had really good skills and he showed me up a couple of times. It was nice to see people with different abilities play together. I didn't feel like anyone was left out, everyone was included. I think if you want to meet new people, challenge yourself and try something new, then this is definitely a project you should get involved in. Today's all about fun, confidence and like trying to meet new people, how they engage and stuff like that. Today I've been working in the arts and crafts area of this project, I guess. We've been doing painting, lots of stuff with glitter, making characters, face masks and stuff like that. I think everyone was generally really happy and especially parents. Parents were just pleased to like, get their kids involved in some arts and crafts and also to, I think, get them out of the house house and do something in their summer. I thought it was fun because I, I wasn't really doing anything else in my holidays so I just thought well maybe if I make some mess in the sports hall it would be fun for everybody. If you've got free time just think what would you rather be doing. It's kind of fun and you can spend time with your friends. I've spent all day with my friends in a safe place doing some arts and crafts. It's been great. We had quite a lot of kids coming to the school and we had a lot of different events going on held by different volunteers so we had football outside dodgeball in the sports hall and uh, arts and crafts in here as well which was quite a hit with the younger children. They got to draw their dream holidays and design some characters of their own. I think just seeing how happy the kids are to actually get out and do something in their holidays. The parents said it was really useful as well because there's not a lot going on in the summer holidays for especially younger children but this event was open to children of all ages so they could just come along and have fun. I would say the skills that I've learned like I've really used them since we've finished, or even during the workshop, we've really used our skills and we've put on these events and they've actually been, they've been a hit in the community. The highlight of today was just working with children you've never really seen before, making new friends and just seeing them play together and stuff. Cranford Fun Day was a day of excitement and learning new things, things you've never done before, even if you haven't tried, making new friends, being all together. Today was a chance to get mostly younger kids together. There's lots of food, there's a bunch of different activities and there's probably something that you've never done before, so it's worth a try. Successful, fun, exciting. Little kids don't usually have the confidence to be like out there alone, but this girl, she was like, around six years old and she was uh, against six people and she was just like throwing balls and she was catching them and she just wasn't getting out. She had a lot of girl power inside of her. It was a very unique kind of event because I've never hosted a kind of event like this like with my friends and I've never volunteered um, with my friends for an event that is for the local area. The teachers here, so basically the staff, they're like really funny and like even if you have a weird friend like Pooj who's my friend even if you guys like sort of mess about in a way they're always there to like laugh on with you. I've made some new friends and I enjoy myself. I, I had so much fun that I ran all the way around. I would say you should come because you can meet a whole new people and have new friends and enjoy the weather. I would tell my friends to come here because it's great fun and you find new friends. The best thing I found like best was when we were playing Death Potato because it's really fun and you're blindfolded. I loved dodgeball. It was so fun. I've done asking and crafts because it's my favourite thing to do. I used um, dark blue. I used dark blue for the sky and at the at the bottom edge I used um, I I put red at the top of the blue so it could make a purple sunset. It's good that doing something around the area because the kids don't really have much to do around here so it's good to kind of get them to all mingle out like of school the hours, the hours the and one. do activities to keep them going yeah. for the summer holidays. The kids have taken part in the painting, the crafts and I think they've gone into the dodgeball. It gives the kids an opportunity to burn the energy, especially with me, I'm in a flat and I haven't got a garden. 
so it gives my kids the chance to come down if they want to play football because I mean there's football rounders and dodgeball going on right now to burn that energy and obviously to meet other children as well that they haven't met yet. My name is Fahana, I'm from Heston and I'm here to bring the girls out for a good day out. Everybody gets together, it's a joint event um, where the kids all come out and as well as the parents get to speak to each other and then we get to see what the kids are doing and help them you know, further on to enjoy the sports or even like to learn how to write their names. We're, we're helping each other. It's fantastic, just come along and see for yourself and let other people know as well the good work that's going on here. They get to mix with probably kids that they wouldn't play with at school. So it's kind of good to come together and just meet new people. Thank you for the fun activities. Thank you for, thank you for this event. Thank you for helping. This has been such, an, such a fun day. Well done. I'd say well done, well done for keeping the kids really entertained. I mean, they're controlling the dodgeball quite well in there, considering how many kids... I just had a go. The volunteers here are very good, um, they're very polite, very helpful, and they're engaging everybody from adult to child. Thanks for helping. It's been... It w we wouldn't have been able to do it without everybody here. Finish!